The story of Sarah Ferguson and the Duke of York has become quite a roller coaster, starting with a great romance, then a divorce, and now a friendly relationship. As the years have passed, Sarah has made it clear to the media that her divorce was because she wanted to pursue a professional career, and royals having jobs is frowned upon. They knew each other since they were little, but they began to date each other when they were older. On March 17, 1986, they made their commitment public. On her wedding day, the Queen gave her son Andrew the title Duke of York, and this is how Sarah obtained the title of Duchess of York. After a few years of being married and leading a life within the royal family, their firstborn, Beatrice, was born on August 8, 1988. Inspired by her life as a mother, Sarah decided to launch her first children's book. Two years later, on March 23, 1990, her second daughter, Princess Eugenie, was born. During these first years of marriage and life as a mother, Sarah started gaining weight, while Andrew was serving in the Navy and on royal duties. Little by little, this caused a rift between them and rumors that Sarah was linked to other men, among them a billionaire, Steve Wyatt. It is said that this was one of the main reasons why they decided to announce their separation on March 19, 1992. In 1993, she created the Children in Crisis Foundation, and four years after separating from Andrew, on May 30, 1996, she was finally divorced. With the divorce, she lost her Royal Highness title, but she was able to retain the title of Duchess of York. After the split, Sarah moved to the United States and decided to work in order to pay off her debts and start a professional career. In 1997, she became a spokesperson for Weight Watchers after being called the Duchess of Pork by the British press. Later on, she left public life for a bit, although she was sometimes seen with her daughters and sometimes with her ex-husband Prince Andrew at private events. In 2010, a scandal arose alleging that Sarah wanted to sell access to Prince Andrew to a supposed businessman and that she could get whatever she wanted from him. Because of this, she was considered persona non grata within the royal family for a long time. The Duke has been associated with a number of women in recent years, but none of those relationships have lasted. Fergie's relationships have also failed, and therefore everything leads back to the relationship between the two of them. After years of rumors that they have been living together permanently again, Sarah now calls her ex-husband my prince the most handsome, as can be heard in several videos she has shared on social media.